Hey guys, welcome back. Just finished with the third um, Creed movie, and I'll just give you my overall thoughts on all three films. So, first one, 2015. I saw this a while back. Uh, to be truthful, um, I actually seen... I heard that these movies came out a while back. I just never really gotten into them. Uh, but let me say, once I started watching the Creed movies, I was, like, hooked to it. I've seen the, Rock, the Rocky movies, so... I knew that this was a spinoff, I knew this came out a while back, but I just really haven't had enough time in my day to actually watch them, and a while back I finally saw this first one, and then the second one, and I just finished watching the third one today, so. Anyways, this Creed movie, I rated it 4 stars, um, I'm not really a boxing fan, but, I mean, I enjoyed Rocky, and I thought, you know what, I'll give these, give this out a try. And I'm glad I did, because this was, there was definitely some Rocky vibes in this movie. I had a good time watching this film, I enjoyed Michael B. Jordan returning to this film, and some cool Rocky references, and overall I actually had a decent time with this film. Um, this film is available on Apple TV, Voodoo, Google Play Services, Amazon Video, and also YouTube. Obviously it probably costs, probably costs something on YouTube. But yeah, I actually had a decent time with this film, and um, yeah, on to the next, uh, I actually saw this on April 10th, 2023, so that just shows to you how, um, uh, how far back it was when I first saw this, and the second one I actually saw on April 11th, so. So, Creed 2, this came out in, I saw this on April 11th, this came out in 2018, um, I actually gave this four, one, two, three, four and a half stars, um, another really good film, I enjoyed this one, but just like the last one. Rocky also appeared in this one. Um, it's weird to see a movie that is better than the predecessor. This movie was actually better, in my thoughts anyways. Um, I actually had a better time with this film than I did with the last one. Another good boxing movie and another good action film. And again, ro more Rocky references. And Rocky does appear in this one. So again, this movie is available on Amazon, Apple, Voodoo, Google Play Services. Um, again, I had a really good time with these Rocky movies. Um, well, not Rocky's movies, but the Creed movies. Um, although, yes, I also did have a good time watching the Rocky movies as well, but I'm not really going to get into that. That might be a review for another time. Um, but I, there's really nothing bad about these movies. Um, yeah, nothing bad at all. Oh, man. This film, yeah, uh, I give it four and a half stars. Came out 2023. This is Creed 3. And I just got done watching this. Um, it's available on Apple TV, Google Play Services, Voodoo. I believe. Yeah, and YouTube. You pay it on YouTube and stuff. Uh, this movie shows that you can run all you want from the past, but it eventually catches up to you. Um, there was Rocky references, but it did not appear all at once. Um, it only appeared once, actually. Um, Rocky did not appear at all in this film, which is a bit disappointing, but I heard that Rocky wasn't going to appear in this film even before this film even released. So, if you are going in thinking that Rocky might be coming in, there is one Rocky reference that I caught, and, but no, he did not make a physical appearance in this film, so. And that kind of figure, I heard about that. Just like with the other three films, I really enjoyed these boxing movies, uh, boxing movies. Um, the fan, as a fan of Rocky movies, and I'm definitely now a fan of the Creed movies, Jonathan Major, Majors in this film really brought in some good moves in this film. Something that we should all be afraid of. The last act had me on the edge of my seat, but I kind of figured who the winner would be. Um, just like with all the other Creed movies, I, Adonis usually wins. But leading up to the final act was really good. The movie was a bit slower at times, it's actually 1 hour and 56 minutes, which is weird because the previous films were 2 hours and actually went by really fast, so um, that's kind of weird, but <laughs> whatever I guess. Um, I mean yes, technically it was shorter, but I think it was because I felt bored at times. I just wanted to get right to the scene where Adonis versus um, Creed or Majors versus Jordan scene, and but it just took a while to get there, that's all. For some odd reason, the time for this movie felt lengthy. There's only two major boxing fight scenes. Obviously, I knew who would win on the first boxing fight scene, um, which was uh, Adonis. Not Adonis. Um, Screen. 
Oh, did I just say Adonis? Agreed. Oops. Because Adonis is Creed. Ooh, burn. Um. Majors. Majors and Creed. Or I forgot who played. Domino. Or Diamond. Dom. And I get Adonis. Did I? Sorry guys if I got um, Adonis versus Creed. That doesn't make any sense because Adonis is Creed. So sorry about that. That made no sense at all. But I already made this review. So. Um. But you know, uh, Domino. Or Diamond. Not Domino. I don't know where that's going from either. Um, I knew who would win on the first box match, then the last act, which was against, um, Dom Diamond, Dom, for as screen. Uh, by far, this was the best acting, and I actually heard that they actually laid some real hits in this film. I actually had a decent time overall, and I gave it a 4.5 stars. So again, if you are a Creed fan, um, I might need to go back through and rewatch it. This might be a film to rewatch, but not. I don't have time right now to watch it because I'm trying to catch up with other films that I missed. Uh, and again, sorry if I said Adonis versus Creed because I just realized that Adonis Creed is Jordan. So I guess Adonis versus Creed means that he's fighting himself, which is not. So I meant uh, Majors versus Jordan, you know, in this film. And I gotta say, Majors played a really good role in this. Um, Oof, ever since you just get first see him in the film, there's always there's like that thing going on in his head, like you know something's up, and sure enough, it just started like he he laid down that first punt on Jordan, punch on Jordan, and uh yeah, it, it just it just went crazy from there. So again, overall, pretty good. Uh this has been my three reviews of the Creed movies. I heard that there's a Creed 4 coming out, but that might be a while. So anyways, if you liked what you saw and want to see more, definitely subscribe and I will do more, more movie reviews in the future. But I think that'll be it for today. Have yourself a great day.